Okay, so this is a, a little tutorial on filters that can be used for filtering waste vegetable oil uh, for making uh, diesel fuel out of waste vegetable oil. Uh, these three filters are Pentec uh, Big Clear uh, cartridge filters. And they're Big Clear because you can see through them. The nice thing about the, the clear filter is that you can see through and uh, the filter canister and monitor the process which is really useful. Uh, this is the big blue 10 inch uh, canister which is identical to the big clear and this is the original design by Pentec and by the way these canisters are sold under a number of names such as Culligan and GE and they're available at most uh, hardware stores in the United States. They come with a one inch national pipe thread uh, fitting for the in and the out. The, the little red button on the top is for bleeding uh, air out. And I modified uh, these canisters uh, so that I could back flush them and also monitor the pressure. So I drilled and tapped for a quarter inch national pipe thread the top here, which allowed me to monitor the pressure. And then I also drilled and tapped quarter inch national pipe thread at the bottom so I could drain the uh, sludge out of the filter. And this, by the way, is the canister or the filter, canister filter. These have uh, almost 20 square feet of surface area, and how they seal is they have a rubber uh, elastomeric. Uh, membrane top and bottom which holds the whole thing together and it seals against uh, knife edges inside the cartridge canister and you can see a knife edge in the lid and there's a mating one at the bottom and the filter goes basically inside the canister there's a little nice little uh, thing in there that seats the cartridge and then you screw this on and that seals the that uh, forces the knife edges into the elastomeric membrane which seals the clean side from the dirty side and the clean side is the inside of the cartridge filter and the dirty side is the outside of the cartridge filter so uh, so when I drilled and tapped the base, I made sure I drilled on the outside of the uh, of the knife edge so that I could drain the dirty side of the filter. And I happened to back flush my filters so I could force clean gasoline backwards through the filter. You'll see that there's an in and an out. The inside's the dirty side, the outside's the clean side. But if you're going to back flush your filters, then you're going to want gasoline to go backwards through the filter, through the clean side, through, which goes into the center here, and then it migrates through the uh, porous membrane of the filter, and it pushes the dirt out of the filter, and then you just drain it off on, um, on a valve that's attached to the bottom of this canister. And you can see, by the way, I have uh, valves at the bottom of each of these canisters for facilitating that. Now the problem is, is that gasoline has a fair amount of, of uh, ethanol in it, or alcohol in it. And you'll see here that the uh, cartridge has disintegrated. And the reason why it disintegrated is because the gasoline in, or the ethanol in the gasoline. And so you can see the filter is buckled normally, a normal filter would not have that So I've the then decided to move on to bag filters. And a bag filter is very similar. Pentec makes bag filters, and you'll notice, by the way, that the tops are identical. And so are the bases, except this one's extra long. Uh, basically, they're the same, and they can screw to each other's lids. Uh, the difference is that the bag filter has about 1 20th of the surface area of a cartridge filter. And this is the O-ring, by the way, that just fell out into the dirt. Okay. And the O-ring goes in this groove here. The 
bag filter. If I can get it out. There we go. Alright, so the uh, situation is the same. Uh, you'll notice that there's a knife edge at the bottom of this canister. It's actually designed or for a cartridge filter. And the only thing that Pentec different, did differently is they drilled and tapped the center of the, of the base so that the uh, base can be drained to replace the, cartridge, uh, the bag filter. And the reason why one wants to make that easy is bag filters fill up a lot quicker because, as I said, bag filters have about one-tenth to one-twentieth the surface area. The other thing is that the, is the dirty side of the bag filter is the inside. And that's kind of convenient because that means all the dirt's inside the, the uh, bag. You pull the bag out and properly dispose of the bag along with the dirt, which is kind of nice. Now the disadvantage of that is it doesn't facilitate uh, back flushing. So what I'm going to do is I've decided to make the inside of the bag uh, the clean side and the outside of the bag the dirty side. Now, can I do that? Sure, why not? It's just a porous membrane and it doesn't matter which direction the fluid flows in. And by the way, you also notice that this screened basket uh, is what the bag goes into and this screen basket basically supports the bag so that uh, you can take the pressure up to 15 psi or one bar uh, across the bag. The bag wouldn't be able to handle that pressure if it didn't have this basket to support it. And so then the bag fits against this surface and then it goes inside the base a l quite a bit like a cartridge filter. It's got the same kind of arrangement. And then it goes inside here and then it screws into the lid. But what they've done is they've changed the lid from having a knife edge. They've glued in a flange that mates with the, the basket and the bag so that when you screw it together it then seals the bag, the dirty side, from a separate from the clean side. Now to facilitate running fluid through the bag in either direction, or let's say in the reverse direction, I created an internal basket that's quite a bit like the external basket, but it's smaller diameter and it fits inside the bag, like this. And this allows me now to move fluid uh, you know, in either direction. So I'm going to make the dirty side of the bag outside of the bag so that I can drain the dirt off and back flush it like I normally do and then screw the whole thing together. Bingo! And we'll have a uh, back flushable bag filter. Oh, and by the way, well yeah, I think I already told you the reason why I uh, switched to the 20 inch long uh, cartridge is because the bags have much less surface area. Okay, so that's it on, on Pentec cartridge filters, big clear, big blue, the bag filter cartridge, and the difference between the bag and the cartridge filter, and also the ability to back flush these things. Okay, thank you very much.